you look so cute Can I make you mine? What you wanna do? Uh, yeah. She don't play and she my type She got brains and I'm top type She that lady, she go dance For those of you who are just tuning into my channel, my name is Brie, aka Smartista Beauty. You guys have really been enjoying my routine videos, so I decided to go ahead and film another one. And this is going to be my fitness routine and just some life hacks about how to stay motivated and what gets me up and pumped and fit and healthy and active. Motivation plays a huge part in my fitness routine. And one way that I would suggest staying motivated is actually keeping a fitness journal or a goal journal. Um, I'm a firm believer, as you guys have seen in my past vlogs, and write it down, make it happen. So don't even just stop at a journal. Get a calendar, a dry erase board, put post-its all over your room. Um, do whatever makes you feel motivated and just keep your goals in front of you consistently. My goals are not like have abs by October, even though I want that. I make one huge long-term goal and then I make a bunch of tiny short-term goals underneath that on how I'm going to get there. Another great tip I have for staying motivated is being inspired. And for me that means visually. I like to keep my Instagram stock full of a bunch of fitness pages. If you go to my Instagram right now and look at all the pages I follow between friends and family, etc., it's also a ton of healthy meal and fitness pages, workout ideas. Now on the topic of fitness models, okay y'all, it is so easy, like I've done it before, just getting really frustrated and feeling like, oh, she looks beautiful and why can't I look like her? But I really do find that these pages can be super motivational if you just don't see them as a competition but see them as inspiration. Like I don't want to look like anyone else. I want to look like Brie, but you know, I'm inspired by this person's work and their progress. Okay, so now we're all motivated. We got all our goals. We got our Instagram pages. My next huge tip, ignore all my keyboards, is to actually put it in your Google Calendar or whatever planner you have. With working out and staying healthy, the results are not immediate, guys. They take time. So sometimes we feel like we can put it off because we won't see an immediate result from it. However, I like to think of working out like I do a class or a job. Like if I wouldn't miss a class for this, then I can't miss the gym for this either unless I'm like dying. My next tip is treat yourself. Sometimes we wait for others to recognize our efforts, but no, reward your own efforts. You put in work in that gym, so put away money and you can use that money at the end of each month to buy like some new workout clothes, some name brand. Like really just treat yourself and reward yourself for your hard work. Now for eating. Clean eating is about 70% of fitness for me. Like it's super important and I'm going to show you one of my favorite breakfast things that I like to make. Um, it's just avocado and then yeah I just love avocados in general. But honestly I try to stay away from diets because diets have end dates and they expire. I like to just continuously try to eat well and of course I might stop at a fast food spot every once in a while but it's not like every day and I try to you know just incorporate healthy stuff in as much as possible. So yeah while I'm waiting for my eggs to boil I munch on these avocados. I love putting like cayenne pepper and stuff on them Then I just make whole wheat toast and two boiled eggs and this is a great pre-workout meal. It's super hearty. It's got protein. It's just awesome. Now for diet and supplements I'm gonna have to make an entirely separate video for that because it's just too much to cover in this one but I love taking liquid multivitamins in place of the hard tablet ones because they absorb so much better into your bloodstream so this is the one that I've been taking for quite some time now it's called Nutriburst and this is not sponsored in any way it's just what I've been taking and what I really like all right, so now it's time to get those gains. It's time to get swole, trying to get <laughs> time to get buff. I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm a fool. So I wrote on these black sheets of paper in this jar different workouts, and this is for when I work out at home. I like to do this and just pick 10. If you're working out at home, I highly suggest investing in a yoga mat. However, most of my workouts are gym workouts, so this is completely just for demonstrational purposes. But I do work out at home when like weather's bad and etc. Now my G 
gym workout routine might have to be also a separate video. This one is mainly an overview. But I do a lot of squatting, a lot of leg machine exercises, pull-ups, all that good stuff. All fitness does not mean the gym. And as you guys have seen from my Instagram, I used to be a tennis player, all four years of high school, varsity. And this is just something I really love to do and it gets me fit and active without really feeling like I'm trying. Now after any workout, I can include this in more detail in my supplement video, but I like to make a protein-based smoothie and or milkshake. And um, this one I'm making here just has non-fat Greek yogurt, um, some frozen berries, some greens, and some banana. And then also my protein mix. And I just blend that all up and it's a great way to incorporate protein into the diet. This one here is just for you. So this concludes my fitness routine. Let me know in the comments below what you guys like to do to stay fit, healthy, and active. And I'll see you in my next video. When the lights off and I feel like you're the only one. Trust you to understand just what we've done and where we came from.